Hey guys, Enter the Stars. 2016 Alien Disclosure? We will find out. 2009, which is the Hebrew year 5769. And we are at 69 years since Roswell, New Mexico. 69 years since Roswell, New Mexico. And in the Hebrew year 5769. We have the movie Angels and Demons. We're going to look at this film, which released on May 14th. Converted from the Gregorian calendar, it falls on May 1st. The Illuminati's second most sacred holiday, human sacrifice, is required. Remember, 69 is the yin and the yang. Disappeared hundreds of years ago. Did they? Look at that again. It's an ambigram. It's the same image, forward and backward. Now that's common for a symbol like a yin and yang or a swastika, but that's a word. Supposedly in the 16th century, some artist created it as a tribute to Galileo's love of symmetry. It was only going to be revealed when the Illuminati had amassed enough power to resurface and carry out their final goal. I wrote a book about it. Now you just heard Tom Hanks talk about symmetry. And in the opening of this film, they fire up CERN, the Hadron Collider, and they develop antimatter that manifests into three globules of universe. One of them is stolen. Here is what CERN was working on. This is called symmetry. And this was also an opera that released at the Cineglobe Film Festival at CERN on the 88th day of the year March 29th is when it ended and people aged 8 to 88 got in free now you tell me that doesn't mean anything it means everything because 88 is really 69 88 is really 69 when you connect 69 together the yin and the yang the dark and the light as you can see here they're showing it within the circle they're telling you everything right here the dark outside the circle then goes inside the circle becomes the yin and the yang the 69 the 88 they're telling you this we are 69 years since roswell new mexico the ufo crash landing and of course we get the obvious yin and yang again angels and demons the dark and the light on the movie poster and the name of this film pointing forward to 69 69 years since Roswell New Mexico and in another bizarre twist of 69 synchronicity this film was a sequel to the 2006 Da Vinci Code the 2009 film was a sequel to the 2006 Da Vinci Code that's 69 again, in case you had any doubts. And so, as we stated, the opening of this film is all about CERN and the Vatican. And for those of you still in denial that the Vatican has nothing to do with CERN or 88, which we just demonstrated with the film festival being leave, letting people 8 to 88 years old get in free and finishing on the 88th day of the year, for those of you that are still in doubt, this is the keyhole of the Vatican, and it aligns to 88 degrees, as you can see here. The same 88 degrees that aligns Washington, D.C.'s rotunda to its obelisk, the Washington Monument. 2016. Will we see angels and demons manifesting in our reality? in these end times is that what is in store for us this year matter antimatter black and white two opposing forces listen but if it were to fall out of suspension and come in contact with matter say the bottom of the canister then the two opposing forces would annihilate one another violently and what might cause it to fall now tom hanks tells the swiss guard to play again 
the threat made by the kidnappers who were going to kill one pope every hour after 8 o'clock. And when he looks down on the recorder, he sees the lightning bolt. The lightning bolt of David Bowie who would die at 69 years old this year. Now you tell me all this isn't connected. Simply unbelievable.